voice mirror. Revelation 11, the two witnesses. I was given a reed like a measuring rod and was told, go and measure the temple of God and the altar with its worshippers, but exclude the outer court. Do not measure it because it's been given to the Gentiles. They will trample on the holy city for 42 months and I will appoint my two witnesses and they will prophesy for 1260 days clothed in sackcloth. They are the two olive trees and the two lampstands, and they stand before the Lord of the earth. If anyone tries to harm them, fire comes out of their mouth and devours their enemies. This is how everyone who wants to harm them must die. They have power to shut up the heavens so that it will not rain during the time of their prophecy, and they have power to turn water into blood. Hundreds of thousands of them ran south to the water's edge. That's when they realized that Manhattan is indeed an island and that they were trapped. And to strike the earth with every kind of plague as often as they want. Massive uh, exposure to toxins. Uh, probably unlike anything we've ever seen before. I mean, here's two enormous towers on fire, collapsing, staying on fire. Everything in the tower pulverized and then released into the air. Pre-pandemic, we were still seeing new patients come in, uh, between 60 to 100 a month. Chronic rhinosinusitis gastroesophageal reflux, asthma. And now when they have finished their testimony, the beast that comes up out of the abyss will attack them and overpower and kill them. Their bodies will lie in the public square of the great city, which is figuratively called Sodom and Egypt, where also their Lord was crucified. For three and a half days, some from every people, tribe, language, and nation will gaze on their bodies and refuse them burial. The inhabitants of the earth will gloat over them and will celebrate by sending each other gifts because these two prophets had tormented those who live on the earth. Uh, in uh, East Jerusalem today, among jubilant Palestinians uh, that the United States had been subject to this attack, we're seeing uh, people applauding, clapping, smiling, uh, happy to, to... But after the three and a half days, the breath of life from God entered them and they stood on their feet and terror struck those who saw them. Then they heard a loud voice from heaven saying to them, come up here. And they went up to heaven in a cloud while their enemies looked on. At that very hour, there was a severe earthquake and the tent of the city collapsed. 7,000 people were killed in the earthquake and the survivors were terrified and gave glory to the God of heaven. The second war has passed, the third war is coming soon.